Hi guys. Hello. We are actually doing a video together this week. I know. The weather isn't that bad. <laughs> well, bit well, icy. It's bad, but not that bad. <laughs> not bad enough for me not to be able to yeah. drive. So. So, better sound quality. <laughs> Especially compared to my previous one. Yeah. Anyway. 3D pen. Cue the intro. No, no, no. Oh, wait. Cue the Christmas intro. <laughs> Welcome back from that fancy Christmas intro that Sean did. <laughs> I'm just going to turn, obviously this is the 3D pen here, I'm just going to turn it on so it warms up while, uh, yeah, while we're talking. Yes, yeah, so obviously this is a little 3D pen, it's just powered from a little power bank in this case. Uh, you can do different three different designs to come with it, which is the 3D butterfly. 3D glasses and it does come with 3D bicycle, which it is on there now. It's double sided that one is. It comes with a little um, sheet, which obviously I've used because I've had this for a few months now. Because I'm uh, just doing some shopping for work and uh, I saw it and I thought, well I've got to, got to give it a Shopping shot. for work? It was, I literally went there to get some uh, pasta. Just leave it open. <laughs> now that I say leave it open, it's going to work, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. It comes like a little sheet, obviously, so you're meant to do it on, but it's not the best one, but it, it, it'll, <laughs> it'll do for what we're trying to do today. It did come with three colours, but unfortunately I've Use them all. used all the blue, and I've used most of the red. So we might be able to just do mostly yellow on this one. Uh, it's still warming up. It doesn't take too long. There it's no, now that I mentioned it, it's yes, nice and warmed up. Uh, so obviously, what we're going to do is throw Sean straight into the deep end. No, because I don't know how to use it. I'm not probably break it. <laughs> okay. You may not be able to see. But you have put it on. The, yes, you could be seeing it. Obviously, we're going to grab some. You know. Sean just up there. Mm. I might need a camera. Well then, what we'll do is we'll just have a quick uh, jump cut while we get a second camera set up. Oh, I think. Get back on. Welcome back. Sorry for that little jump cut, but we now have a sec uh, second camera so you can actually see what we're making. Yeah. <laughs> um. It's just warming back up again. It shouldn't take too long because it was only gone for like a minute. Um, the main point is try not to get this tangled when you're trying to use it because it, it's a right pain. So I went for that to go on. Basically, um, while it's warming up, you have the feed button. Yeah. Which you tap and it'll start. Tap and it stops. Or you can hold it down and then it'll keep going until you let go. Mm. And you've got speed, you've got slow, medium or fast mm -hmm. and that's just on off so you don't have to touch that one. Okay, so you, that's a quick way to try not to touch the end like I'm doing. Uh, okay. I can say, is anything going in? Now it is. <laughs> yes, obviously, uh, that was just a quick overview of what Sean's going to do. I always do slow just because it's easiest to. Uh, where does the little camera down in? I can use that one. There we are. So, I'd say the main thing is the cable. <laughs> and this one's going to do that to get rid of all the red. So we're doing 3D glasses now apparently. Yeah. I'll let you do the butterfly, yeah. So you just press it to start and then the other you can just go all the way around. This is not the best thing at the moment, or just go 
relatively slow when you build it up that way. You can go really far away and have the really long windy ones. We'll be close and have it like screwed. It's on slow. Oh, right. oh, it's on slow now. <laughs> it's probably a bit easier to have it on. So you might need to swap places because this is gonna be really hard for me. Yep, no problem. Do you want to do the butterfly or 3D glasses? Your choice. I'll do the glasses. Okay, okay. We'll set up then. <laughs> right. Pardon me? Can you hold the wire? Yes, I can. Uh, the wire. Wire. Yes. To start. This is really hard to hold. There he's going. I say if you want to go a bit quicker, you can. It's your choice. Yeah. <laughs> That's medium. Yes, obviously, uh, while Sean's doing that, I uh, <coughs> got this from Lidl's. Yeah, by our work. A little needle? Yeah, a little. Yeah, it looks like that. I know, nor was I. It just, it just saw it, I thought, bloody I've got to get one of them. Because I have been toying with the idea of getting one of these. But I just haven't, you know, got one. Was it expensive? No, no, it was below tenner. Okay. So good, I wish I had two just to give to someone yeah. else. Yeah. And it, it does set quite hard, actually. It's you do have to be a bit careful with it, but I'm well, sure going to find out when he uh, takes it off the plastic, which is always a uh, tense type thing, really, because you always feel like you're going to break it, and sometimes you do. I want to make sure that's connected there when you go back. <clears throat> Obviously, these glasses will be too small for both our heads, trust us. It's quite, a, it's quite a little there. Uh, Good little uh, toy, really. You do have to be a bit careful, and we are powering it from a power bank, which is that's how handy it is, really. It does come with a little power supply in there as well, just, just a little plug in wall and USB. I, I will, there will be a link in the description below to the website where you can get this exact model and then the, the pro version as well. Right. Do you want to do the bottom two bits yeah, as well? Okay. Yeah, so obviously there's a pro version as well, which is uh, quite handy. Yeah, the wire gets in the way. Um, the actual filament gets in the way. This one's PLA filament. It's not exactly expensive to get new ones either, so I think. I think it's around four or five quid, but I'm not exactly sure because it might have changed since I last looked. It's like a 10 metre roll, which is similar to the same sort of size ones Sean's holding. I think the tip goes to around 120, 180 degrees Celsius. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit, I'm afraid. So you do have to be a bit, bit, bit careful of that. So kids, ask your parents first. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't, there's no... I can't see any age restriction on the box, so... I think it's just, just be careful if you do use it. Comes with a three year guarantee as well. So when I made mine, I didn't like make mine as full as this, that's why. Because if you've ever done 3D printing, or got a 3D printer, you can, you can just do the outside bit quite sturdy than the inside. You're just filling quickly, you know, oh, actually. Okay, so if... I 
so I'll just hold this down a minute. Oh, so I have had actually took this apart because it did get stuck once. There we go. Because the motor bit is actually at the, the end bit. Uh, and then the heating element's on the front, so it's pushed there, so it got, so got stuck in the middle line. It comes a little stand in there, it's quite cool. So do I just peel it off? Yep. This is where he breaks it now. That's going off not too bad, actually. I think it's probably because you didn't, you didn't put it quite close to it, did you, when you did it? No. So you got that going through, which is good. It does make the odd little bit of a ribbon, which I, you can't see from that camera. Okay. Nice thin ribbon. Can't do it there as well. Oh, not too. Nice thin ribbon. <laughs> if you grab the other two bits off, we'll uh, stick it together. Oh <laughs> no. That's fine, though. we could fit them. I need to turn that on now, don't I, to stick them together. Got some scissors, got the end. <clears throat> so you got them both off, there we go. Yeah, this is it. Oh, by the way, thank you for our recent four subscribers for subscribing. <laughs> you got a bit of red. Where did the red come from? He was on there. Oh, I, did, I didn't mean to. Can we cut that bit off as well? Yeah. yeah. Okay. And that bit there. <laughs> So it's always handful have a little bit of scissors here. That bit went a bit wrong. <laughs> Camera's there, sure. <laughs> that bit went a bit wrong. But which end is that, the round end or the straight end? That end. Yeah. <coughs> okay, what I'm going to have to do is uh, connect it together, which is always interesting. If you've got a lighter, what I do is I just lit up the end a bit and then just stuck it on. Because well, now there's two of us here, we can actually join, join it together, which is useful. Just give it a second to actually come through. Now the problem is holding it still. Just uh, hold it with reason. Ow. <laughs> Now I'm touching the hot melt of my ears. <laughs> okay, what I'll do is I'll reinforce that one. <laughs> it's Sean's first go at it, so you got to give him some slack. Just take it like a few seconds to dry. There you go. I think you felt that off, baby. Round as well, I might go to get this one while you didn't. Know. Okay. It's just the little bit. It's just some of this, that's what it is. I know I'll break them for a while, but.
<laughs> so, so short. Tell us this being your first ever three D creation, three D pen. It's hard up apart from modification there. Yeah. <laughs> so, what do you think of that? Like, it's quite good. It's ease good. of use. You think it's quite easier to use, or it could be. Yeah, I think. I think it'd be wireless to start with, battery powered. You know this. Um, well, like I said, this, that's quite a heavy yeah. power bank because that's the one that charges up my GoPro batteries as well. But yeah, quite good. <clears throat> like I said, the Pro version, I think, slightly bigger. You got better temperature control mm. and better speed control, mm. which is, I think, what you're saying is the problem. And I agree with you, it does come out a bit yeah. too quick at times. But yeah, it's. It's not bad, it's nice and sturdy as well. The material's sturdy. <laughs> the actual 3D glass is probably not so much. Well, it's not bad for your first go, actually. No, this is really strange in this side. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is quite strange, actually. Um, yes, in case you haven't already noticed, there is an elf on the shelf in the background. <laughs> I know it's a bit late in the uh, month for it to be started. Yes, but due to the snow. Yeah, so we haven't been able to yeah. come around to do proper videos. But, uh, yeah, we shall... Uh, is there anything else you want to mention about it? Or any other thoughts, process, nothing else? Um, I, won't be in, in, I won't be buying one, let's just say that. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember exactly how much it cost, but it was like it was under a tenner. Mm. Quite good for that, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. I thought it would be over a hundred pound. Oh, no, no, no. So, so I reckon it's for a starting off video. Yeah, it's quite it, good. It's quite good, yeah. You'd have to be a bit careful about the end being a bit dirty. And warm. <coughs> so very warm. <laughs> Yeah, it uh, definitely works. Well, so I have took it off. All the, the heating element is literally in the end of the motor over here. Yeah. I guess it's uh, time for you to click on the videos over there. Is it over that there? side. That side. Over here. This is normally my side. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> on this side. Our next video will be <clears> on Christmas Day. Yes. Um. Not telling what it is. No, no. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. And we might have a video Wednesday, we're not too sure yet. Yes. I see. But we'll let you know on Twitter. Yes. Good to watch on 14, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I hope we'll see you in the next video then. <laughs>